Hello everyone, my name is Jess Flores. I am a staff nurse from the Medical Intensive Care Unit, also known as the MICU, here at Mass General Hospital. I work with Marianne Casimir, who is also a staff nurse from the MICU. Together, we will present to you this video on the nursing care of patients on venovenous extracorporeal membrane oxygenation, also called VV ECMO. The ECMO care team in our MICU includes cardiothoracic surgeons, critical care pulmonary doctors, ECMO specialists, ECMO trained nurses, pharmacists, case managers, social workers, physical therapists, occupational therapists, and dietary services staff. All these care team members are involved in taking care of our ECMO patients and their families while in the MICU. Our ECMO nurses are highly trained and experienced nurses. We are specially trained to care for complex ECMO patients and recognize complications throughout the entire ECMO therapy. We closely monitor our patients' vital signs, such as their temperature, heart rate and rhythm, and blood pressure. We adjust all blood pressure, heart rate, and anticoagulation medications as needed. This helps to make sure that all the organs and tissues of the body will continue to receive enough blood and oxygen. We give our patients antibiotics and other medications to prevent and treat infections. We monitor lab work every four to six hours to make sure that their electrolytes and blood counts are within range. If their blood count is too low, we give them blood transfusions. With the help of our fellow nurses, critical care technicians, and ECMO specialists, we turn and reposition our patients regularly. We check their skin and treat any skin breakdown. We also make sure that our patients are fed while they are asleep and that their nutrition is working well for them. We provide daily updates to family members over the phone or at the bedside about their loved one's condition, and we participate in daily rounds. Daily rounds are when the care team visit the patient and review their condition and plan of care. We also participate in family meetings. Family meetings are short conferences held to keep the families informed on the patient's condition and for the team to hear patients' families' concerns. At the end of our shifts, we update the nurses coming in. We let them know of all the important details that has happened in the previous shifts and our current shifts. This helps to make sure there is a smooth transition to safely care for our patients. We encourage family members to be involved, spend time with the patient at the bedside, talk to the patients even if they are sedated, speak to them in a calm and reassuring voice, gently hold their hands. We also encourage families to keep a journal, which we provide of the patient's progress to help guide the patient as they recover from their illness. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, you can always contact the MICU at 617-726-8048 and request to speak to the patient's nurse or one of the medical team members.